there's a little extra electricity in Madison Square Garden tonight. Many wondering whether or not Morocco will do as he did once before and take the title from Morales as Captain Luis Albano leads the magnificent Morocco into the ring. Morocco up on the rope does not appreciate the jeers of the fans. At this time, ladies and gentlemen, may I introduce the manager. Here he is, Captain Lewis Albano. Introducing first to my right, the challenger from Sunset Beach, Hawaii, weighing 247 pounds, the magnificent Morocco. And his opponent from Culebra, Puerto Rico, weighing 240 pounds, the Intercontinental Heavyweight Champion, Pedro Morales. Morocco looks very cool, calm, and collected. He knows this is a golden opportunity for yes, him. Yes, indeed. A consummate professional is Mr. Morocco. He is a master inside that ring. Morocco had some choice words for some of the fans about ringside. And Mr. Morocco must pay attention to business in there. You don't want to turn your back on anybody out there in that ring, that's for sure. Morales not known to take any cheap shots at anybody, but when the title's at stake, you do whatever you have to do to win. Morocco back to the rope. Referee asking for the clean break. Now backs himself off the rope. Morocco does. Morales trying to power Morocco back into the corner and does indeed. Right, give me a break. Give me a break. Let's go. One. Two. He'll go toe-to-toe -to -toe with anyone, Mr. Morocco will. Absolutely. Gutsy son of a gun. He's got power, speed, agility. Has all the tools, Vince. Side headlock here used by Morales for control. Well, again, more of a defensive Absolutely. maneuver, is it not? Let your opponent make a mistake. Rocco brings him in a little closer now with a hug. He's going to throw him off here in a second, get out of this thing, or have it broken on the ropes. Won't be a clean break either, I doubt it. One never knows with the likes of Morocco, and Morales shoves Morocco off. Got tired of waiting. Push is coming to shove. Kind of gradually see this thing begin to build and build here. Absolutely. Neither individual wanting to make a mistake, and I think it's reflective in this match. Mistakes can be very costly, and when a title match like this one is, you don't want to be the one to make the first one. Well, it took Mr. Morocco a long time to be number one contender. Stepped over, on, and through a lot of people to reach his point here tonight. Morocco now off the rope. Morales goes down. Morocco, no! Double cross, double cross. Oh, the big left hand right to the esophagus. Raised him right off his feet. Morocco takes a breather. Checking it out with the timekeeper. Morocco got that grin on his face. He, he may have something in mind. He is quite the strategist, Mr. Morocco is. Because I know Morales doesn't have the power to push Morocco around the ring like that. Standing wrist lock turned into a hammer lock. Nice. Oh! oh! Now that could have been anything. That, that could have could. been an automatic disqualification right there. If, in fact, it were in, intentional, but the referee didn't, did not even see it. So, therefore, only a question. Very quickly done. More damage to Morales. Now that Morocco asserting himself. Pedro certainly having his problems. 
And Mr. Morocco not about to let up. Snaps the bottom rope right across the throat of Morales. Morocco does a lot of things in that ring that other wrestlers never even think about. He's got Morales in trouble here. Front face lock pulls him over. Beautiful neck drop. Covers his man. One gets two. Got to have Morales in more of a compromising position than that to get a three count. Going to work on him with a front face lock here. Tire him out a little bit more. Good position to choke a man from here, Vince, without being seen by the referee. Referee's on one side. You've got another hand to do whatever you like with. Well, consecutive counts of two on Morales. Morocco doesn't seem all that disturbed. He's a patient man. He'll just keep wearing you right down. A few knees like that will give you negative attitude, guaranteed. Morales is going to take a ride upstairs. Suplex, oh. beauty. Oh, that should do it. We're going to have once again Morocco crowned intercontinental champion. He took his time coming over. He's not hooking that leg, two. Vince. Oh, the rough. He three. had the hand back there, but didn't hook the leg. Morocco stuck his hand back there as if the hook the leg didn't hook it. Why? I don't know. Oh, oh no. right over the top. And landed right and hit his head right into the chair. That must be at least seven to eight feet from the ring, and he struck a chair. Where it's one thing to wear a man down, it's another thing to punish a man. I Absolutely. think that's what Morocco is trying to do. Him right now. Oh, no. Right Where into the steel, steel. steel rail. There is no doubt that is exactly what Morocco is attempting to do here. Morocco is. You can hear these boos. Morales still on the floor, still on the concrete floor, trying to get his thoughts together, trying to get his breath together, trying to get his head together. Reaching down for him now, a handful of air. Morocco wants to bring him in. And suplex him right back inside. Has him up. That suplex, suplex was harder than the first one, Vince. Morocco covering Morales again for the fifth time, I believe. Two. And the knee of Morales coming right up and hitting Morocco in the forehead. Backing right off. Morales can absorb a lot of punishment, as is evident. Basket with an elbow, did Morales. Rakes the face, does Pedro Morales. Can't count Pedro out at any time. Nor can you count Morocco out. Drop kick Drop by kick Morocco, beauty. outside again. Pedro, making what some would consider to be a gallant Morocco effort to get back again. in. Oh no, oh no. Ramps it to the iron ring post. Kicked to the chest. Morocco hammering away, just destroying Morales. There's not going to be any more Pedro Morales left. Brutal right hands there by Morocco. Vicious man when he has the upper hand. He wants the title. No way, shape, or form. As soon as that referee gets anywhere near the count for outside the ring, Morocco will be over there. The Spanish blood is hot now. And Morocco coming over. Morales is about to explode. Morocco in a bit of trouble now. Going to suplex Morales in the ring again. left hand right to the jaw that time. Morocco's in trouble. Again on the side of face. Outside now, Morocco. Now Pedro going outside. Oh, gonna get even.
Morales breaking the count by rolling back in and right back out again. Oh! Morales in the ring and certainly has control of this match at the moment. Morocco was draped around that ring post. He got smacked in there pretty good. Pedro reaching for a handful of hair. That's Morocco out in the apron now. Oh, my. Lifted him up in the rib, striking the iron turnbuckle. Oh. Morales Morocco. laying in the blows, and Morocco stuck a right hand in there. Interesting maneuver, Pedro Morales. Look at this. Look at this. Oh. He just made a soprano out of him. Morocco reeling around the mat. Anything to stay away from Morales, who has all the momentum in the world. To the room. Back body down. Beauty. Morales down into the facial area. Things not looking that well for the magnificent Morocco at the moment. I think Morales is almost even, man. He's about Ooh. one or two more shots into the steel rail and he'll be even. Morocco not having an awful lot behind the right hand we saw him throw a moment ago. Morales has sapped his power. Turned into a slugfest. Referee. Referee inadvertently knocked down. Oh, that wasn't inadvertently. Certainly didn't appear to be. Morales. That was ringing. Pulling him up, literally. Trading blows here. Rights for lefts. Morales got more steam in his shots at this point. <laughs> Referee a little reluctant to step between him, but I don't blame him. Both have shown very little regard for the officiating here in the latter stages of this match. Very, very little. Morocco and Morales outside. Neither man wanting to stop. Each man wanting the upper hand. Referee trying to get in there now. Morocco. Actually, there's no reason for him to stop at this point. Vince a bell rung. They don't really know what the outcome is, neither one. They're obviously going to keep going until one guy is too tired to continue. Morales oh. bringing him out. Dragged him right out. Wow. Did he ever take a shot? Morocco. I think Morales is even. <laughs> Better watch himself, Morales. Morocco's had enough. After 14 minutes, 27 seconds, referee has disqualified both the magnificent Morocco and Pedro Morales this bout a double disqualification. Morocco wants more of Morales. Look at him. Absolutely. He's coming right back. Morales wants more of Morocco as well. Both men are going to be full of aches and pains tomorrow, man. Well, it looks like more aches and pains coming right now. Now, if you're the official, what do you do in a case like this? Absolutely. This match is terminated. This match is over. Morocco has nothing to gain at this point. 
That is arrogance for you.